Once upon a time, there was an old mother pig who had three little pigs, and not enough food to feed them. So when they were old enough, she sent them out into the world to seek their fortunes. The first little pig was a very smart pig. He had a little house with a lovely fireplace. He saw a beautiful house and thought he would build his own. So he went out into the woods and set about the work. In no time at all, he had constructed a nice little house of logs. When it was completed, he went inside and was so pleased with himself and out of the beautiful house that he took a nap. When he woke up, it was night. He couldn't find the door and was in big trouble. Soon the first little pig realized that he was lost. He heard dogs barking in the distance. He heard voices speaking harsh language. The first little pig wondered if he should climb a tree or climb down a river bank. The first little pig sat down to think his situation over. He thought and he thought. Finally, he had a brilliant idea. So the first little pig prayed. Dear Lord, I have an idea. I know you want me to find my way home, so if it is in your will, I will stay here and walk straight into the mouth of the wolf that is lying in wait for me. Please help me to do so. I believe in you, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. He prayed that prayer and stayed where he was. He sat in the dark for several hours. After some time, the first little pig realized that it was daylight. The trees were bright with sunlight. He could hear the sound of people talking. As he approached the wood, he smelled smoke. It was a familiar smell to him. He soon found that the fire that he smelled came from his little log house. A wolf had caught the first little pig sleeping there. He had eaten him from the inside out. The second little pig was less fortunate. He had not built his house of sticks. He had built it out of corn cobs and straw. And so he was found sleeping in the house of thorns. The wolf caught him as well. When the wolf found out that the second little pig did not have corn cobs, straw, or a fireplace he enjoyed, he ate him also. All three little pigs prayed to their mothers. All three little pigs died within a few days. The moral, when we put the need of others ahead of our own, God will bless us and he will take care of us.